We have these amazing natural areas in Burlington and very few people know about them. I feel like that we're at a crucial point in human cultural evolution. For a while, conservation was just conserving chunks of land, and now we realize that isn't effective, really, because plants and animals need to move between these larger areas. The Burlington College land has been degraded over time, but we're trying to reforest it and try to bring it back to a closer approximation to its, its uh, natural community that would have grown there. Mott Land Trust has been around for 40 years and has conserved uh, over 500,000 acres in Vermont. Now, some of the peaks in Vermont and even in other states did have hotels on them. They were like destination places, but a lot of those burned or were closed at the start of the century. There were a lot of wildfires up on Camel's Hump. Uh, retaining canopy cover, retaining functional ecosystems is the most cost-effective, efficient thing you can do in terms of climate change. You don't have to build insulation. You don't have to build solar panels. You're not, you're not, um, it's just saving what you've got is the easiest, best thing you can do for climate change. The Vermont Land Trust has conserved over 2,000 farms in Vermont. I mean, you drive in any town in Vermont and pretty yeah. much there's conserved farms. Cities lose biodiversity and functional ecosystems, not because they're actively saying, let's destroy them, but but it's by chance, mostly. It's because they're, they're because there are all these different groups who don't talk to each other. Why do I feel land conservation is important? Because I, oh, so many reasons, but um, I think that, you know, in its biggest sense, you can't, you know, if people aren't connected to the natural world, they're not healthy. So retaining these kind of healthy ways to be outside, and, um, and I guess, you know, an open grassy field isn't sufficient. Retaining woods, birds, the ability to see animals really connects us to the natural world. We evolved uh, with these wild animals and plants and I think of them as communities as well. We're conserving land. 